my next question it's about um, the prasad and charnamrit that's given in the temple uh, i would uh, like to know how is it different from like when muslims go to hajj they bring dates and uh, zamzam pani so why is it like muslims have to stop themselves from having the prasad or taking the charnamrit how is it different this was a very good question she's saying that when hindus go to temple they give prasad when muslim go to hajj they give date so what's the difference the difference is prasad is food which is put on to gods in hinduism you find the hindus hinduism is separate the hindus what they do they go to the temple and they give the food to god allah says in the quran in surah anam chapter 6 verse number 14 allah feed it everyone but does not require to be fed how can we human being give food to god Furthermore, Quran says in no less than four different places, which I quoted earlier, Surah Baqarah chapter two verse one seventy three, Surah Maidah chapter number five verse number three, Surah Anam chapter six verse one forty five, and Surah Nahl chapter sixteen verse one hundred fifteen. Hurramat alaykumul maithu the wadda muwalamul khinzir, wa ma oila li gair la bi. Forbidden for you for food, ah, that meat, blood, the flesh of swine, and any food on which any name besides Allah's name is taken. So if you take on a food, any other name besides Allah's name, it is prohibited. It's haram. When Muslims go. to hajj or umrah when they give date no one says this date has been given to almighty god date you know because one of the main fruits of saudi arabia is date so when you go we get that fruit just as a gift no muslim ever says that this date has been given to almighty god to allah and date is very nutritious it is very nutritious and it's very healthy so this is just as a gift how you get sweets you know when you come from india go abroad you give sweets so this is a very delicious fruit and it is the main fruit of saudi arabia it has no link no one says that this date has been given to almighty god if the hindu gives date to almighty god even eating the date is haram if some hindu gives date to almighty god and says this is prasad eating the date becomes haram So anyone takes any name besides Allah on that date, that date will also become haram. So that's the difference between Muslims and Hindus. We don't believe that Almighty God requires to eat. We human beings require to eat. Hope that answers your question, sister.